coordinates in the first quadrant. Here I have some graph paper here um, with all the quadrants on it, but we're looking at this section here, the first quadrant, which is this bit in here, the first quadrant. Now, um, a big graph is split up into four quadrants, the first, the second, the third, and the fourth quadrant. And in the middle we have 0, 0, which is referred to as the origin. Um, we have the x coordinates and the y coordinates, the x axes and the y axes. And when we're doing coordinates in this area here, they're all positive numbers. Really all we've got to make sure we do is put them in the right order. A coordinate will be made up of two parts, the x part and the y part. You notice the x part comes first because that's how it works alphabetically. So x, if you know this horizontal line is x, you know you've got to go across first and then up. So if I'm plotting the coordinate 4, 1, I need to go across 4 and up 1 and plot that coordinate. So that, that could be my point A. If I wanted to plot the point uh, 2, 5, I would go across to 2 and up to 5 and plot that. Now if I got that the wrong way around, um, then I would have gone across, I would have gone 5, uh, maybe gone up 2 and across 5, it will be over here. So you've got to be make sure you're getting it the right way around. Always go across before you go up or down. Um, if you do negative coordinates, you go across to the left, but we're worrying about this quadrant first. So, across, up and down. And if I'm trying to take the coordinate of a point that's already drawn, say point C, C would equal, well, to get to C from the origin, I need to go across 5 and up 3. So I need to go across 5 and up 3, so the coordinate would be 5, 3.